baby. I know, you're so cute. You wanna say hi? I know. Hi everyone, it's um, me again, I'm back. And I wanted to do a unboxing, or an unboxing, of the Byron Air Pure Indoor Living. It's a hand steamer, and I bought it at Ross. Originally, it was $60. And I got it for $19.99. Let's just open it because I don't like looking at boxes. I've been looking at it for two days. All right, the first thing that I see is this little steamer extension. Um, it's got little um, fuzzy little, I don't know why I wanted to call them nipples, fuzzy nipples. I don't know, but um, it has that. Then it has a more of like a terry cloth fabric one. And then the fun part. Oh, good. Okay. So, we have the all-purpose hand steamer instruction manual with a little metal-looking thing right here, which I'm not sure what that's for. Then we have another one of the terry cloth um, things that slip on, I guess. Um, and it's just a triangle shape. I guess this is for larger surfaces. But, ooh, a scrubbing one. We have another one the same um, texture, except on one side it's the terry cloth, and then the other side is like the terry cloth, but with a kind of a blue scrubby feeling. It's, I have another one, which looks like a chamois, like it has um, a chamois feeling to it. Come over here and sit. <laughs> Okay. All right, then, ooh, this is serious, the claw. Um, it has, I guess this is for this, and this would go over these, and it's just a handheld apparatus, and then inside of that is this weird little cup. I'm not sure what that's for. A funnel, I'm assuming that's how you fill the water, you know? And what is this? This is, <laughs> I don't even know what this is. <laughs> this is like a little terry cloth thing again. I'm sure it goes over something. Have, ooh, a squeegee. So here's the squeegee tool. No, I might as well open this. And this is apparently for the glass, for mirrors, um, for bathroom tile and stuff like that. So it just steams it and then you squeegee it away. Have, I guess a vacuum looking thing. I guess it gets in areas um, and steams at the same time. I, you could take this off right here and just have that. <clears throat> Maybe this is where this goes. Yeah, no. Then we have this big daddy. I feel like I'm about to fight crime with this steamer. <laughs> and I'm assuming that this would go over this as well, as well as the blue fuzzy nipple one. Oops. Two little brush things. And they look exactly the same to me, so I don't know why there would be two, but whatever. Um, maybe if one gets lost. So really, ooh, they're really hard. Like the bristles are really, really, really stiff. So you can barely even move in. I'm kind of pushing kind of hard. So I'm assuming this is for smaller spaces for scrubbing, maybe around the toilet or something. Here's the direct steam, steamer thing. And that's basically um, just for really small spaces. I will be using the crap out of this one. We have the hose. So apparent, I mean obviously this would hook on to this, which is the actual handheld steamer body itself. Um, and it looks like it holds 500 milliliters of water. Um, once it gets to this area, it's 400 milliliters, and then it shows you, you know, that you can, um, you're gonna have to refill it. And in the back, it has this, and it has, it's good that this is attached to the back of this so that you don't lose it. And you would fill the water in the back right here. And one thing I, uh, well, when I looked at it, I didn't realize that there was an actual cord. I thought it was cordless. Um, and so I was like worried that maybe the cord wouldn't reach into the bathroom or wherever 
you know, because <clears throat> we don't have a plug in the bathroom, so we did go buy that little exten extension cord. That was about 375 or so for a 15 foot. But look at this goddamn cord. Oh my God, this is like a really long cord. So seriously, like, I don't think I'm gonna need an extension cord. The last thing is this little handle. And I have no idea what this is for. Maybe, oh, okay. I realized I fixed it. I mean, I figured it out. No, I didn't. I think, yeah. So this, I guess, hooks onto the end of this hose right here. And steaming away. Okay, Kia, you can't be in the middle of my theme now. Ew, ew, ew. Okay, sit. Sit down. Thank you. Oh, a strap. Just in case I want to strap it onto my arm and carry it like a purse. The world, Kia. What are you doing? So that is the extent of this. Let's see. Um, this is what the box looks like. Uh, we did get it at Ross, as I said earlier, and um, I cannot honestly wait to use it. Like I'm so effing excited right now. I will be steaming everything in this apartment, okay? Bathroom, kitchen, windows, mirrors, floor, everything. The only thing that says don't do is like appliances, I mean not appliances, is um, electronics like computers, TVs, um, anything like that that you obviously wouldn't put water on. So don't steam your computer, okay? But it, has, it does have a one year warranty, it's environmentally friendly, obviously because we're only using steam and we like that around here because of the dog, you know, we don't want to poison the dog. Um, thank you for stopping by my channel to see my review on the Bionair and let me know if you guys have ever tried this or used it or know somebody who has. Um, I would love to know, you know, how your experience went with it, if it was easy, simple, um, if it actually works how it's supposed to work, I have no idea, but I will let you guys know how I think it goes and I will talk to you guys later. All right, bye.